In the animal kingdom, many creatures must hunt for their food, while others must constantly stay on guard to avoid becoming someone else's meal. This is the delicate balance of nature, where predators and prey play a constant game of survival. Predators have evolved powerful adaptations like sharp claws, keen eyesight, and lightning-fast reflexes to catch their next meal. But prey animals aren't defenseless. Over millions of years, they've developed their own incredible survival strategies to avoid becoming another animal's dinner. From blending into their surroundings to running at incredible speeds, prey species have evolved a variety of adaptations to outsmart their predators. Let's take a look at some of the most fascinating ways animals avoid getting caught. Camouflage. Blending into the environment. One of the most effective ways for prey to avoid predators is by becoming nearly invisible. Camouflage helps animals blend into their surroundings, making it harder for predators to spot them. Some creatures have colors and patterns that match their environment perfectly, while others can even change their appearance depending on where they are. For example, leaf insects look almost exactly like leaves, making them nearly impossible to see when they sit still among foliage. Arctic and snowshoe hares change their fur color with the seasons. White in the winter to blend in with snow and brown in the summer to match the forest floor. Some animals, like the cuttlefish, can actively change their skin color and texture to match their background in real time. By disappearing into their surroundings, these animals make it much harder for predators to find them. But camouflage alone isn't always enough. Many prey species also rely on movement, or lack of it, to stay hidden. Staying perfectly still can be just as important as having the right colors and patterns. Mimicry. Looking like something else. Some animals avoid predators by pretending to be something they're not. This survival strategy, called mimicry, allows prey to trick their predators into thinking they're dangerous, toxic, or even something inedible. A great example is the owl butterfly. The large eye-like patterns on its wings resemble the eyes of an owl, scaring away birds that might otherwise try to eat it. Another fascinating mimic is the hoverfly, which looks like a wasp or bee but is completely harmless. Predators avoid it because they associate its yellow and black stripes with painful stings. One of the most famous cases of mimicry is the mimic octopus, which can change its shape, color, and behavior to imitate toxic sea creatures like lionfish, flatfish, or even sea snakes. By copying dangerous or unappetizing creatures, these animals boost their chances of survival without needing to be truly toxic or strong themselves. Bright colors. Warning signals. 
In nature, bright colors aren't just for show, they can be a serious warning. Many prey animals use bold patterns and striking colors to signal to predators that they are toxic, bad tasting, or dangerous. This adaptation helps predators learn to stay away. One of the most well-known examples is the poison dart frog. These small but brightly colored frogs from Central and South America produce toxic skin secretions that can make predators very sick, or even kill them. Their vivid blues, reds, and yellows serve as a warning to any animal thinking of taking a bite. Another example is the blue-ringed octopus. When threatened, this tiny but highly venomous octopus flashes its electric blue rings as a final warning. If ignored, its venom can be deadly. The monarch butterfly is another classic case. Its bright orange and black wings warn predators that it is toxic due to the milkweed it consumes as a caterpillar. Birds that attempt to eat a monarch often become sick, teaching them to avoid anything with similar colors in the future. Bright colors can be a life-saving adaptation, helping prey avoid fights they wouldn't win. Living in groups, safety in numbers. For many animals, survival isn't just about being fast or well camouflaged. It's about sticking together. Living in groups provides protection from predators in several ways. From confusing attackers to making it harder for any one individual to be caught. This strategy is known as the safety in numbers effect. A great example is schools of fish like sardines. When a predator approaches, thousands of fish move together in rapid swirling patterns called bait balls, making it difficult for the predator to focus on a single target. This confusion can buy the fish enough time to escape. On land, zebras use a similar trick. Their striped patterns blend together when they stand in a herd, making it difficult for predators like lions to single out one zebra to chase. Another well-known example is meerkats, which live in tight family groups. While some forage for food, others stand on guard, scanning for danger. If a predator is spotted, they sound an alarm call, giving the whole group time to escape to safety. By working together, these animals increase their chances of survival, proving that sometimes teamwork is the best defense against predators. Speed and agility, outrunning danger. When faced with danger, sometimes the best defense is a quick escape. Many prey animals rely on speed and agility to outrun their predators, using powerful muscles and sharp reflexes to dodge attacks and make a fast getaway. Incredibly fast land animals include antelopes and gazelles, some of which can reach speeds of nearly 100 kilometers per hour. Unlike the cheetah, which is built for short bursts of speed, these animals have incredible endurance, allowing them to outrun predators over long distances. Among birds, the ostrich relies on its long, powerful legs to sprint up to 70 kilometers per hour making it the fastest running bird on earth. When chased by predators like lions and cheetahs, ostriches can change direction quickly to evade capture. 
Even small creatures like hares use speed to their advantage. Unlike rabbits, hares have long, powerful legs that allow them to sprint and make sudden zigzag movements, making it much harder for predators like foxes to catch them. By using speed and quick reflexes, these animals give themselves the best chance to escape because in the wild, sometimes running for your life is the only option. Armor and defenses. Tough to eat. Some animals survive by making themselves difficult or painful to eat. These creatures have evolved tough armor, sharp spines, or other physical defenses that discourage predators from attacking. A great example is the armadillo, which has a tough bony shell covering its body. When threatened, some species can curl into a ball, making it nearly impossible for predators to get to their soft, vulnerable parts. In the ocean, the porcupine fish has an incredible defense. When threatened, it inflates its body into a spiky ball, making it much harder for a predator to swallow. And on land, the Australian echidna uses its sharp spines as protection. When a predator gets too close, it rolls up into a tight ball covering itself in spines that make it a painful meal. By being tough, spiky, or difficult to swallow, these animals discourage predators from even trying. Because sometimes being too much trouble to eat is the best survival strategy. Nature is full of incredible survival strategies. And prey animals have evolved amazing ways to avoid being eaten. Whether it's blending into their surroundings, running at lightning speeds, or using tough armor for protection, these adaptations help them stay one step ahead of their predators. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment to let us know your favorite animal adaptation. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe!